must decrypt. Cannot be the dead. No, no, it can't be! Stay back! That's a bread knife, my lord. Do you mean to butter me? Stay back! Back, I say! I'll fight you! If you insist. You'll have to kill me! Luckily for you, it won't come to that. This kingdom is mine! Mine! I will not yield! Time to go, my lord. We're late for the crowning ceremony.
Dead. You, you, you think you've won? You haven't, liar, Fritz. I sent him away with orders to destroy you. Quiet. The mess you're in, you don't know the half of it. You're a blight on this world. The whole lot of you. A rancid disease. You don't deserve Mercia. To the victor, the spoils, my lord. You must win Mercia to deserve her. Get me off this thing! Soldiers here. Let these hey, people boy. bear witness to this the carnage way. that awaits them. We need to go fast. Right behind you. Burkred, you old beauty. I hardly recognized you there. Pile the soldiers here. Let these people bear ah, put me down. Only way you go down is with a rope around your neck. They'll be coming for him. Stay alert. Pile the soldiers here. Let these people bear witness to the carnage that awaits their kingdom. Trouble ahead! <laughs> Go! We'll cover you! Help! Eivor! Stick his face in the horse's ass! Whoever trains these Marcian soldiers should be relieved of their duty, I think.
keep our wits away. Uh. Prayed on the St. Chad at Tamworth. I was a monk. I should have stayed there. Did St. Chad die with his axe in his hand? St. Chad will be revered for avoiding the axe. I wish I had done so myself and not taken a path full of violent honor. The old gods will fade from our sight in time. God forgive me for I have sinned. <laughs> King! Don't let them get past us! Change has come, Burgred. 
All that remains is a coronation. A return with the Lords of Mercia. Burgred, my love! My lady, are you injured? Did they hurt you? No, no. I'm fine. Move along, Lord. Your king awaits. Your death will come, Danes. Your end was writ the moment you came for me. I have made damn sure of that. The zealots will know your name soon enough. No matter where you are or how far you travel, they will hunt you down. Enough of that, you squeaking sparrow. <laughs> Let my brother be the lunatic of Tamworth. Zalit. What does he mean? Ignore him. Desperate pleas and prophecies. Nothing more. Walk with me, Wolfkist. We have some time before the ceremony. Where to? Nowhere in particular. I only want to celebrate. Didn't think you were the type. You have drawn a dark conclusion about me, haven't you? That is all well and good. I've drawn some about you as well. Are you leading a lamb to slaughter? See what I mean? Dark. Too dark. You there! Get lost! Sit down. I know I have been a cock, but you are a good fighter. I respect that. Let it be said that Ivar the Boneless considers Eivor a friend. Who calls you Boneless? Some backrout I killed in Hibernia. Used his guts to shine my spear. Called me Boneless because I move like a reed in the wind. Not because you're always too drunk to plow? Valhalla. That is where I am bound. I can smell the blood and taste the mead. I will sit beside the High One with my axe in hand. A fitting end for Arachnason. You would think, eh? Me, Hafton, we will be there. But Uba... No. I do not think we are chasing the same victory. Not anymore. What does Uba want? To grow old and fat on the farm somewhere with little Ubers to chase about. He wants an heir. It's a common dream. Not for a warrior. Not for Drengir like us. He was different before. But this place, England, it softened him. What was he like before? Like me. Ferocious. Wild. With respect, I don't think anyone is like you. If that is a compliment, I missed it. All I mean to say is, things were easier some time ago. If it bothers you so much, why not strike out on your own? Because he is my brother. I love him. And I will do what it takes to drag him back around to my way of thinking. We are warriors, all. And that is to the death. myself again. Oh, did I miss the crowning? He's worse off than I am. Oh, 
Where is my son? We sent word to Repton, but we've had no word, Lord. I suggest we carry on. You sought me out, old friend. And here I am, standing before the throne from which I reigned not long ago. You stand before us to accept this Witten's unanimous decision that you are unfit to rule and are hereby deposed. We demand the abdication of your kingdom and your crown to Thane Chairwolf. Mercia has spoken, Lord. The crown. Is that you, old friend? Ah, yes, I see it now. <laughs> Forgive me. The robes of righteousness sit so loosely upon your shoulders. If the heavens mismark me as king, forgive its obscuring light. Amen. Now, where is my crown? Forgive my nerves. Here I am, an upright man who never once learned how to bend the knee. And yet, I shall try. Ah, how simple it is. How easy to kneel without fear and feeling. He's mocking you, man. I'd kill the fucker. Worry not, Dane. I shall resign this crown and this pagan-infested kingdom and the favors of these two-faced men. But I will do so on my terms. My demands are simple. Firstly, you must... Uh, you fool. Look around you. You have no leverage here. Plead for your life, for it is the only thing these men will grant you. Yes. Yes. Forgive me. I... I do not harm me. I beg of you. Please. I'll go anywhere. Here. I, 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 I resign it here. Take this lord and his wife to Rome. He is hereby exiled, never to return. The Witten recognizes King Chairwolf of Mercia, second of his name. A just king, a merciful king. God save the king. It better be worth all this trouble. Mercy and soldiers marching on Repton. Leofrid. Loyal to the ugly and the bastard. Gather what men you have and split them between the north and south gates. That should divide his forces. Cheobert is there. Evo, you must save my son. He will come through this, I promise. I will stay here with Cheobo. Go.
Jailbelt. Have you seen Jailbelt? No, but we caught sight of Leo fleeing across the river. It was chasing someone. It has to be Jailbelt. It's the only prize worth testing in this place. down there, friend. Please, you do not want to do this. Leofred, let him walk. You answer to me. I answer to my king. Our silence deeds with this. Play it by, Leofred. There's nothing left to fight for. We've stormed Repton. Only a matter of time. 
I cannot do that. Then you will die. Someone will. You can't win this, Leopold. Even if you defeat me, the Rackleton has won the day. I have fought many a day in my time. I am still standing. <laughs> Slowing. Bah! You are strung will fain. Urquid was lucky. To start in the way of you and Mercia is my duty. I will die before I yield. Finished. Not yet. Fight me, heathen. It. No appeal to your god or your king. I swore an oath to serve Borgren to the death. I fought. I lost. We both know how this goes. An honorable thane fighting a dishonorable war. Burkrid abandoned him, betrayed his trust. If I were Leofrid, I would want to know. Why rob him of this last glory? A warrior ready to meet his god and bask in his praise. To live will only lead him to shame. It's not an oath he would keep if he knew the truth. Then choose. Truth or glory. Stand, Leovrid. Live to fight another day. What? Your loyalty to Burkrid is not a loyalty returned. He resigned the crown and fled to Rome. He's gone. You lie. Lie to a man seconds from death? What would I gain? He saved himself and left you to die. All this fighting, it's for nothing. For no one. To betray one so trusted. So close. It's a dishonor. Worth. Thousand deaths. Eivor, you have shown me a great kindness. It, it is only fitting that I do the same. 
At Venonis, there is a statue with a scroll laid in a small bowl. You must burn it. A scroll? Your name is on this scroll. At Burgred's request, I put it there. When it is found, the zealots who read it will hunt you. Who are they? It doesn't matter now. You haven't much time. Burn the scroll, or they will never stop hunting you. Where will you go now? Rome. Come on. Let's take you back. Careful. You're injured. I'm all right, really. A few nicks and cuts from the battle, that's all. These wounds will heal quickly. You're lucky. I threw myself at him, Abel. But he only toyed with me. He knew I couldn't touch him. You should have stayed hidden. Jailbird, this wasn't your fight. It was. It was our fight. Yours, mine, my father's. Mm. Thor lends me strength. And you did. You showed courage today. Bravery. You are a boy no longer. Back there with Leofred. I didn't think you'd spare him. There's no honor in killing a man misled. He believed his king would die fighting for Mercia. He knows the truth now. And with that truth, he forges a new path. You were right about him, Jailbert. And right to believe the line that divides us can be thinner than it seems. Look at you! Bloody and battle-worn. Could be chieftain of your own clan with courage like that. No less than the King of Mercia, brother. One of these days. And how is my father taking to his new role? See for yourself. You're an Otlinger now. Or Athling, I think you'd say. Next in line for the throne. It's an honorable title. One that demands good judgment. Be careful who you trust. My son. Are you well? Yes, father. Well enough. He honored you today. Fought bravely against many stalwart foes. You have my thanks. All of you. And my blessing. We knew what this alliance might cost us. But it's over now, and everyone has gained something. Silver, honor, allies. Agreed. Today we turn a new page. All of England must know. The Kingdom of Mercia has a new king. The remaining kingdoms of England won't respect your path to power. Nor will many in my kingdom. Burgred's soldiers will stand tall in the face of this turmoil, all across Mercia, against us. That we shall remedy soon enough. I am riding for Oxenifordshire directly, to forge an alliance with some thanes there. Shall I go with you? Not till I know more. Linger here a while if you can. Strengthen our friendships. I will send for you soon enough. Sigurd, I would feel better if Cheobert was... ...away from here until Mercia is more stable. Would you welcome him among your clan? Hmm... Do you have a horse, young Atherling? I do. A young steed called Theobald. Good. I can ride with you as far as the River Nene. You may find your way from there. Thank you, Sigurd. This puts my mind at ease. Be 
You ready for my call, Aber? It will come. You and Sigurd make a good pair. The future of England will be pagan from top to bottom. Take this, Wolfkist, as a sign of friendship. But should you call, the brothers Ragnarsson will come. You honor me, Uba. See that? Sly bastard trying to win your heart. Well, two can play at that game. How kind of you, Ivar. My pleasure. Our friendship is the best thing to come from this mess. Maybe Chelbert too, the brave little twig. That is good to hear. Now then, Leofrid said there are hunters after me. Zealots. If I don't clear my name, I will be marked for death. I should head to Venonis. The wind calls me back to Randvi. Let's tell her the good news. I've heard all Danes are cursed with slow brains and fat tongues. Care to prove me wrong? Most men choose to be loud or stupid. Impressed that you manage both. I will take you on. Brilliant. Some flighting spirit. How about a wager? Here. Thank you. Let us begin. I have sparred against champions and bested each one. Oh, to beat such a bracket will surely be fun. Ah, quick to bite back. Be careful, young Earth. You're a misfit, a half-wit, a foolish old grouse. You're a weakling, a milksop, a catcher, a louse. Brilliant! I'm the greatest of flighters, a master of verse. Your pride is appalling, and your rhyming is worse. Got you there, young Irv. Ha! <laughs> I'm impressed. You are as sharp as that axe on your belt. As promised, I will have my winnings now. Take the gold. You've earned it.
sing a song. That song. You have spent some days in a longship. Oh, many. <laughs> See this salt blasted hair. The talk of pummeling over the years. All that seawater. Feels like hay now. Better keep away from the horses then. <laughs> you are very quick and sturdy by the looks of you. But you are not from that Ragnarsson camp there in Repton. I would have recognized you. I belong to another clan. What are you doing away from yours? I have been cast out. Too old, too frail. Dead weight, as they say. I will have to get used to watching the sights of war from afar now. No shame in that. Not many of us can say they lived long enough to simply retire. You have earned it. But have I? Or have I missed my chance? I thought I knew what lay ahead, but now that is foreign to me. Embrace it. Sail the seas, write your songs, and bellow out in the winds. Sounds nice to me. You are far too young to speak so wise. There is a bright future for you and your clan. I would like to add to it. Take this key. And if you find yourself in Repton, seek out my quarters near the docks. There is a large tree out front. Inside you will find a few of my most prized items. Take them. I no longer have any need. You honor me. Call it a gift from the old guard to the new. Odin guide your way, young drinker. I should keep an eye out for this old raider's home if ever I am in Repton. This must be that old raider's place. He said he wanted me to have his things. Is that everything? This crate. 
Wait, is filled with songs. Must have taken a long time to write them all out. I should return this crate to the old raider. These are some trinkets you left behind, old man. Ah, you've come back. Why are you wasting your time with me? This crate has all of your written songs. This is not a gift I can accept or repay. You will want to revisit these someday. They should stay with you. I had forgotten all about them. Something to work at on this new journey of mine. You have only the setting sun to tell you when to stop. And maybe not even then. That is twice you have earned my admiration. Please, tell me your name. Eivor. Eivor. If the gods will it, I will find my seat at Odin's table before you. And there I will speak of you so that when the time comes to claim your seat, they will greet you by name. Farewell. If we ever cross paths again, I know you are someone I can count on. I hope you know the same is true for me.
is running short. I should head to Venonis and clear my name from the Senates. Otherwise, I'm marked for death.